welcome to Purse Buzz. So today I'm going to be doing a hair tutorial. It's nothing really different as far as technique goes. It's really just the product itself. And I'm using the Sultra and it's the Sultra Bombshell. And it's the one inch. And I've just been using this lately to give myself that naturally kind of wavy, almost like a perm style that you guys have been asking about. So I'm going to show you how I do that with this product right here. So first thing is I'm going to put on my glove. And this glove actually comes with it. You can see it's a little big for my hand, but we'll make it work. And this is going to protect my hands from burning, but still you don't want to hold the curling iron in this hand because it's really hot. Then I'm going to apply a little bit of a heat protective product, and this is a Sultra Heat Safe. So I'm just going to spray this throughout my hair. You can actually spray as you go, but just for quickness sake, I'm going to just spray all over, kind of let it air dry, and I'll be right back. is whether or not you want to put it to the left or the right and remember with the heat protectant product you want to spray as you go along if you're really particular if you have really really sensitive hair my hair can take a lot of abuse so I'm okay with it all right so then what you're going to do is you're going to split your hair I'm just gonna have mine go to this side right here because that's what it wants to do today and you're just gonna start using this product so what I like to do is uneven curl some really really thick strands some really really small strands and as the day goes by, it just loosens up and it just gives you this really nice natural wave. So I'm going to take my curling iron and I'm just going to go to town. First thing is you want to section off your hair. But for me, with this style, it's just so messy and carefree. I don't really care to do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this piece right here. It's a long, flat piece. And I'm going to curl this towards my face. It's the very first one. And as I'm doing this, I'm kind of twirling it around the rod. And I'm going to hold it. Okay, and then I'm going to release it. And I'm going to hold this in my hand for a little bit just to make sure that that wave really stays. If you don't want to do that, you can just clip it up with a bobby pin. Now, if you use a bobby pin, it's really going to be tight, tight curls. And that's not what I want. I want it to be natural and loose. So I'm just going to take this and flip it over. And I'm going to work on the next piece. And since I'm going to make this one really close to my face, I'm going to take a small piece. And like I said, it's going to be really just haphazard, carefree. And I'm going to flip this so that the tip is pointing down. Slide it out. And I'm going to hold it. What I like about the bombshell is that this right here, this handle, is really easy to hold. It's not just a straight shot. So I'm going to take this, I'm going to roll it away from my face. And I'm actually twirling the hair. And I'm going to release it. The real trick is to keep your hair intact. Like if it just releases like that, this is what happens. So what you want to do is take it and twirl it and hold it. And you want it to maintain some sort of wave. And as you can see, this one is totally different than this one. And that's what gives your hair that really nice, just, I guess I keep calling it carefree, but really it is. It's the, yeah, my hair's kind of wavy, it's kind of crazy, which I love because it's really low maintenance. Okay, again, I'm just going to do the same thing. And really, that's all I do all over my hair. It doesn't have to be perfect. And that's what I love about it is that if there are different pieces of hair, then you're going to get different results. So I'm going to release it and have a little bit more of a defined curl. Now I'm going to use really, really small pieces like this. I'm going to put this one closer to my face. Now I'm not going to have the rod close to my roots because I don't want really tight, tight waves. I just want them to be all over the place. And you can see this one's like a more of a prom style. But that's what you want. You want it to be just PC and different. Again, I'm just going to take it. Make sure the rod is pointing downward. I think that's the big, big trick to making this look the way it does. Okay, so this side is done. So it's just really PC. It's chunky. It's like all crazy. I'm going to finish off this side with the same technique, and I'll be right back. take this chunk that's right here and I'm going to bring it forward and I'm going to curl that and that's going to give my hair a little bit more volume than normal. So I'm going to lay it flat like this, not on your scalp, away from your scalp. I'm going to hold the ends right here because I don't want that curled. I want that to be a little bit straighter. And I'm going to release it. This. Next thing is you're going to let it cool, maybe five to ten minutes. Maybe you can go run and do your makeup and then you're going to spray it. 
And the reason why you don't want to touch it while it's hot still is that you want it to cool down. Like if you run your fingers through it now, it's just going to straighten out your hair and you're going to be back to square one. Okay, so the next thing you're going to do now is you're going to spray your hair. I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Mega Spray. And I'm just going to spray this. As I'm spraying, I'm running my fingers through, just kind of scrunching it up a little bit, giving it more volume, and just really separating the curls. And that's it. You know, you just let your hair relax throughout the day, let it do its thing, and it's going to get a little bit more, like, worn in. The curls will relax. You may even get, like, some flyaways. But I think it's really cute the way it is. It looks very natural, very beachy and summery. Thanks again for joining me at First Buzz. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!